Hey guys, it's Lori. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new here. Today I'm going to be finally unbagging my Ipsy Glam Bag, my regular Ipsy Glam Bag, for the month of May. I know, we're into June already. This came like super duper late, the shipping like it was printed, I had a label, and then it just like sat and sat and sat, and then like it finally showed up, and then I was super sick, and I didn't want to film. So, now that I'm better, and even though it's in June, I figured I'd still unbag this. Maybe you guys still want to see what I got. Since I like literally never get the regular glam bag, I thought it would be at least worth showing you guys what I got. Um, I picked the bag this month, decided to get it, because I just thought this bag was super duper cute. It screams summer to me. I don't know. It just seemed like a fun bag. Um, it's got a little pink pull tab there. I thought it was cute. I couldn't resist it. Um, it looks like everything is inside, although there is some stuff in here. It looks like one item. Oh no, these are add-ons and points items, I think. Okay, so everything's in my bag. That's part of my bag. These are add-ons and points items. Um, this was the theme, Let Yourself Bloom, or is it ahead of the pack? I'm not sure. Um, and then... Oh, I, hate, I loved it when they used to like show us the items in here. This just says SPF Mythbusters. So we don't get to know about our items, but I'm going to show you the items that I got here. Okay, I'm going to try to find the one that I picked. And sorry, I still kind of have a cold going on. So if my voice is funny and if I'm sniffing, it's either like still my cold or it's allergies. I'm not sure. Either way, it's super annoying. Okay, so the first item that I picked is all bubble wrapped up nicely here. Actually, not the first item I picked, the item that I picked. Um, also, what helped me decide to get this bag. So this is from Coors. This is the, right, it's from Coors? It's like been so long since I picked this. I just want, yeah, Coors, okay. It's kind of like the bottle feels a little bit oily. So it's like it leaked a little bit, but it looks like a full bottle. Okay, this is the Velvet Skin Drink in Santori Grape. And this, you can tell, is a really big bottle. Like, I think this was a third of the full size. Um, I don't remember. I just remember looking into it and being like, hey, that's actually a really big size. We're going to go ahead and pick that. So this is 15 milliliter, 15 milliliters or 0.51 fluid ounces. I think full size might have even been one ounce. I'm not sure. But this is a Coors product I haven't tried. I've wanted to try it. So I figured this was a great way to try it out. So excited about that. That's that and this cute bag are the reasons that I like went with getting my Ipsy this month. Okay, now I'm going to show you the items that Ipsy picked for me. Um, so, wow, speaking of like, this is a really good size too here. Um, this is the Elemis Pro Collagen Rose Cleansing Balm. And this is 20 grams or 0.7 ounces. Um, I've never used the Elemis Rose Cleansing Balm. Oh, it definitely smells like roses. And it looks a little like oily on the lid there. It's kind of like melty. I don't know. Um, that's a lot of product. Uh, I've tried the regular Elemis cleansing balm and I really like it. So I'm excited about this and it's a great size. So that's super fun. Okay. And then what is this? The Ciate London Velvet Skin Cream Blush and the shade is Cheeky. Um, I really don't use cream blush or bronzer products, but this seems like kind of a fun thing. If I wanted to try it out, this would be a great way to do it. So maybe this summer I will give it a try. Otherwise, one of my daughters will totally use this. If not, um, it's a fairly small size, but I'm not complaining. I don't think you really need to use much to put a like dot of blush on each of your cheeks. Uh, so this is five grams or 0.17 ounces. It's a pretty color. Like I like that pinky color. I feel like that would go really well with my skin tone if I did decide to try out some cream blush. Okay, next thing out of the package is the Aceology Brightening Treatment Mask. This is 15 milliliters or half an ounce. <coughs> sorry. <coughs> I was going to try not to cough for you guys, but sorry about that. Um, I have used several different Aceology masks. I feel like they all are very similar. Um, so this, you cleanse skin, squeeze mask under your fingers and or any applicator, apply a thin layer evenly relax for 30 minutes and gently peel off from the edges. Yeah, I feel like all the Aceology masks I've had are peel off masks. 
you know, this seems like a fun size to try out a mask. I have several, like I said, from Aceology. I don't think I have a blue one. I think I have a yellow package, maybe a green packaged one. I'm not sure. I don't remember what they are. Um, this is a brightening one, but this is a good size to try it out. You definitely get several applications out of that. So I'm not upset about getting that. And then the last item in my bag is actually a full size item here. This is the Pear Nova. I don't remember if this is a lip liner or an eyeliner. Yeah, this is the lip liner in style. It's not, does that say style? It looks like, yeah. The E kind of looks like an O, so I can't tell if it actually says style or if it says stylo. Um, I was hoping it was gonna show me the color here, but it's not going to. We're just gonna open it up and see what it looks like. I've forgotten that I got a lip liner in my May Ipsy bag because I just um, redeemed points on my Glam Bag Plus or my Boxy by Ipsy Charm. No, Ipsy by Boxy Charm. That's what it's called now. Uh, I just redeemed uh, points for a lip liner from them for that it should be coming with my July bag, I believe, but that's okay. Okay, that's super pretty. I don't know if you can tell, but it's just like a completely neutral, like pinky color. I like that. That's like my everyday lip color. So not upset about that at all. That is definitely what I'm going to try out and use. I'm just hoping that it wasn't this brand that I like this exact same thing that I redeemed, redeemed points for. I don't remember. I know it was a full size lip liner in the 600 points, but I don't know if it was this, but Okay, so that was what was in my actual bag. Now I'm gonna show you uh, my points items that I redeemed on this account, as well as the add-ons. Okay, so speaking of size of items, this is the points item I redeemed. It's the Eye Duty Niacinamide Brightening Cream. This is three milliliters. So we got this little teeny tiny product and then like a face oil or like in comparison, like a mask. I don't know, this is teeny tiny. Obviously it's an eye cream, you don't need much, but that is just like super tiny. Okay, and then we, I got, well this, I say we, because the two add-ons were actually things that my two daughters picked. Uh, this is a Gold Fadden MD Light Treatment Dark Spot Corrector. So one of my daughters added that on. And then another daughter added this on. These were both the 350 add-ons. Uh, this is the Brow Friends Forever Clear Brow Gel. So it was supposed to be a full-size item. I don't know that that's actually full-size. That seems really small, but um, I don't know if you can see it, but it's got a really cute little brush. I guess you don't want big bristles for eyebrow products. So maybe this is full-size. It seems sample to me, but yeah, those were my add-ons and point items as well as, let's see if I can pick this up, um, my bag items. That lid really wants to like shine in my light. Um, these were my items for the month of May. Again, I apologize that this is getting out super duper late. Uh, it came super late and then I was sick, but better late than never, I guess. So anyways, that is my glam bag for the month of May. Um, yeah, thanks for watching guys and have a great day.